May my superior strategies lead us to victory. All right, let's move. We have managed to recruit some rather intelligent officers to our cause lately. I only mention it because I am their complete opposite. I truly envy people like that. They know everything that is going to happen in a... No, Master Cao Chou. Stra For example, on the other hand, when it comes down, that holds true for... I get it. Thank you for your kind explanation. So you are the tacticians brought to me by Shun Yu and Guo Jia. My name is Man Chong. My specialty lies in designing traps for castles and general defensive preparations. I am honored to make your acquaintance. My name is Shun Yong. I am an expert. I see. Master Cao Cao, you have many mighty... However... In order to eventually quell the chaos, you need skilled tacticians that can guide... Master Guo Jia, Master Man Chong, Master Shun Yo, and myself. Each of us has our own field of expertise. Together, we can help guide you on your path. Excellent. I look forward to seeing just how far your ta... My army is still rather small. But it has many talented warriors and strategists. I think our capability is sufficient for the task at hand. Our first move is to slay Tao Qian and obtain his lands within Shu province. I would like to hear your opinion on the situation. My lord, please forgive my impudence, but do you wish to attack Tao Qian in the name of vengeance? If that is what the world thinks, then so be it. However, the point in attacking Tao Qian... Master Cao Cao is old friends with Master Yuan Shao. Similarly, Tao Qian is close to Yuan Shu, who is also at odds with Yuan Shao. I see where this is... I know that we cannot make our move while our army lacks in size. However, if we do not seize this chance to take Shu province now, I seek to bring an end to the chaos and instill a new sense of order in the land. In order to do so, I must overcome the chaos through... A new sense of order. So, attacking Shu province is the first step. Of course he must deal with the coward Tao Qian. You can make your move and cause him to think you wish to talk. At the same time, you place an army behind him. That actually makes things quite simple. We attack where their defenses are the weakest. Haha. <laughs> Tao Qian won't know what hit him. I see. With that supposition in mind... First, 
I think we need to dispatch an army to put down the resistance within Qing. You mean... the former members of the Yellow Turbans that are terrorizing the area? How... does that relate? If you make a move, Tao Qian will think it is for revenge. If he truly is the coward Master Manchong suggests he is, he will hope to parlay. Once he approaches the front lines, that is your chance to slay him. Even if you fail, it will slow him down, enabling an auxiliary unit to st Interesting. Many lie. Let's go. Hmm. Cao Cao's gaze is turned outward. He does not appear to notice. Then now is my chance! The name Cheng Gong will soon be known a We will slay Tao Qian and seize control of Shu province. I will need your talents to make it a reality, though. These yellow turban rebels are quite skilled. If we can defeat them and get them to join us, it could greatly strengthen our army. Although we don't have the time to do it properly, let's just try to recruit as... You have to be kidding. Let's go! Now is the time! You've got something I'd like to get my hands on. Come on, hand it over! Your weapons and skills are all amazing! I'm sorry for my rudeness! The men have started to return. I hope we can bring the others back, too. Who might you be? Looking for a fight? Yeah, you're pretty good. I'll, I'll give you that much. I'm sorry for everything. All of it. I follow you from now on. I never expected that I would meet someone who is so strong. I'm going to follow you. The enemy is going to attack us here. Everyone prepare to defend this spot. 
This is exactly how I envision things. Wow, you're better than I thought. Need a horse? I'll be here if you need me. Hey, get on in here. This isn't good. Welcome, welcome! Thank <laughs> you. 
Do please come again. I've got some great stuff here. I appreciate your business. Hey, get on in here. again. I've got some great stuff here. I appreciate your business. Huh. Oh! 
The bridge is being held by Tao Qian's army. We will have to remove them if we wish to cross to the other side. This is to finally bring an end to the chaos. We must succeed, no matter what obstacles stand in our way. Take that back! Father, I am so sorry. Cao Song was not ordered by Master Tao Chen. Please, will you allow us to explain? There is no need. We are here for the sole purpose of defeating you in battle. <laughs> So you have no ear for reason. What will happen to Shu Province now? We can crush all opposition with overwhelming strength. It seems that is Master Cao Cao's way. We have managed to secure the bridge. Now, let's make our way to Peng Castle. <laughs> this is exactly how I envisioned things. He explained he didn't mean to kill Cao Cao's father, but unsurprisingly, was executed anyway. I just can't forgive... Out. I'm not going to fight any longer. Jan's auxiliary unit has taken a position at the foot of the mountain. We must try to defeat it before it joins the main unit. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. I cannot help Tao Chen like this. I need to retreat if I can. This is exactly how I envision things. Lanchan. Looks like you applied your skills during battle quite well. I'll be keeping an eye on you. The people of Shu Province lived simple lives huh. of peace and prosperity until Master Cao Cao came and took all that away. Bringing turmoil to the lives of the innocent is a crime I cannot overlook. Master Cao Cao. No. We must capture that position. I'm relying on everyone to do their best here. We're going to secure this area. Everybody, forward! Our target has been determined. Capture! Damn it! I'm 
Sorry, I couldn't help you more. Brother. Too good for the enemy. It'll be put to much better use by us. Let's go capture one of those unsightly positions. Follow me. Forward. Our objective is to capture that area. I had no idea Tao Tao's forces were so powerful. <laughs> this is exactly how I envision things. Mancha. Looks like you applied your skills during battle quite well. I'll be keeping an eye on you. that stole the vegetables? I'm gonna make you pay for that. A robber? What? You don't look like Tao Chung's forces. But do we have to fight? Let's go. Now is the time to attack. Time to show you something special. So you're not these after all? I'm sorry for the misunderstanding. My name's Chuchu. Let me know if you ever need any help. It's the least I can do. <laughs> this is exactly how I envision things. <laughs> We've received supplies from Master Shu Ju! An apology for attacking us! Oh, thank you! Now we can fight at least a little longer! to avoid conflict if possible. But it seems I will have to be prepared to go to battle after all. This man is driven by hatred and wages war to satisfy his desire for vengeance. I cannot let him take control of Shu province. Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. Capture of that area is our goal. Secure it, and we will take the enemy's spirit as well. It's about time we got moving. I think securing that area will prove beneficial to our cause. You have brought ruin to shoot, Zhao Zhao. 
simply for the sake of your own personal vendetta. How could I lose to such a man? I am willing to be reviled. If that is the price I must pay to continue on my path. Liu Bei gave us a bit of trouble, but we've managed to mostly pare down Tao Chang. The enemy moved. Yes. Our forces have become more powerful than I imagined possible. It is only a matter of time before Shu Province falls to our onslaught. It's... it's Lu Bu! Yan Province is under attack by Lu Bu's forces. Curse that Lu Bu. He could not have picked a worse time to invade. In response to Lu Bu's attack, castles... Upon hearing the news, Lord Shaho Dun and Lord Shun Wu have already set out for Yan... De defecting You mean the castle lords? So, Lu Bu was the source of my premonition. I never expect... They defected due to Lu Bu's presence? I could understand them surrender. Hmm. It... Everybody! We must quickly return to Shu Chang. I want Lu Bu driven from Yan Province immediately! I bring news. Ding Chao has fallen and Master Li Qian has been slain. Most of the castles throughout Yan Province have fallen. <sighs> Uncle, I promise. That leaves only Sha Ho Dun and Shun U in Juen Castle. We must send them reinforcement. No, Master Cao Cao. Juen Castle will be able to hold out for a little while. Hmm. Yes. I agree with Master Guo. It's settled then. We will head to Ding Tao. Once it has been reclaimed, we will send aid to Sha Ho Dun at Juen Castle. Let's go! This is the moment when we take back Yan Province from Lu Bu and his men. Forward! Those that cannot keep up will be cut down where they stand! This place belongs to Master Lu Bu. You will never take it. These vile thieves. We must expel them from Ding Tao as quickly as possible. Let's go! Now is the time to attack! Enemy greatly. All units march. All right, stop it already. I can't bear this any longer. Such a bore. 
Wow, you're better than I thought. The enemy is on its way here. Take defensive positions. Example for everyone else. I have to retreat. I'm sorry, Master Lupu. We have taken Ding Tao back. There is no need to stop now. <laughs> this is exactly how I envisioned things. That was quite a spectacle. Truly amazing. Overcome. I will retreat for now and regroup. Ah, you're finally here. Sorry for the trouble. We must stop the enemy here, even at the cost of our lives. I can also do this! Drop the guard! We must stop the enemy here! Even at the cost of our lives! Somehow they managed to hold off our assault. All units, prepare to retreat! This is exactly how I envision things. Thank you. Your assistance will enable us to take the offensive now. Wubu and Chen Gong are mere beasts who know not of morals nor righteousness. Huh? I will slay all who look to stand in Cao Cao's way!
I can't keep up with you any longer. Oh, so, so, no. I am going to join Lu Polo. I will show no mercy to those who betray me. All units advance. I want Xiang Yao's head on a pike. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. This is a strategic location and must be defended. Uh, to be defeated like this, I should never have betrayed Cao Cao. Zhang Yao is dead. Now, we must use this momentum to face Lu Bu in Puyang. <laughs> this is exactly how I envision things. You're doing really good. Great even. <laughs> Men of South Sao's army. I'm afraid this castle now belongs to Master Lubu. Please make your exit in a swift and efficient manner. Thank you. I'm sick of you shameless traitors. This place belongs to my lord. Leave at once! I'm not backing down. It's time to get serious. Everyone is to remain here and defend this position with their very lives. They've made it a fair way inside. It looks like I must think of something quickly. I have no need of strategy. All I need to do is crush these maggots beneath my heels. Like you no, applied your this. skills during battle quite well. Trust your guard. I'll be keeping an eye on you. We must stop the enemy here, even at the cost of our lives. Such a bore. Hey, you're really doing well out there. I expect nothing less from you. Going to show you some of this. 
such a bore. Hmm. This battle bores me. You can have your pathetic castle. Okay! We've won this battle! It's quite a relief that we were able to take back Hu Yang. Huh. We successfully reclaimed Yan province from Lu Bu. Hmm. We are not worthy of your praise. No, Master Shahudun. Given the circumstances, Lu Bu himself... The problem was all of the castles across Yan province. Master Cao Cao displayed his strength in Shu... Yes. The people do not... put their faith... Much like the campaign against the Yellow Turbans who opposed the Han, or the coalition to combat Dong Zhuo, who disrespected the Emperor and terrorized... I see. So displaying our sense of righteousness along with our strength can go a long way in gaining the understanding and support of the... My lord, I bring news. Emperor Xian has escaped from Li Jue and Guo Xi and is requesting assistance at Luoyang. Ha <laughs> ha! What excellent timing. My lord, we should assist the emperor and take him under our protection. Nothing could be more right... Although, if we are to aid the Emperor, we must do so quickly. I am certain that the other warlords are thinking the exact same. Yes, I agree. As soon as our preparations are... Hey, Shun Yo! You're pretty quiet for being a strategist. I thought you guys simply gave our Lord good ideas without having to be... Easy now, Master Dian Wei. Master Xun Yo has his reasons. He once proposed a plot to his friends and was ultimately... So he prefers to... Yeah. We were just betrayed by Master Chen Go. I see. I... Master Man Chong. All right, let's move.